Hello friends, this is last part of Laravel 5.8 CRUD application tutorial, by using Ajax with bootstrap modal, and in this part we will discuss how to delete or remove MYSQL existing data using Ajax in Laravel 5.8. In previous part, we have already seen how to edit or update existing MYSQL data in Laravel 5.8 by using Ajax with Bootstrap modal. Now let's start discussing this part, so we have go to Ajax index.blade.php file, and here we have already put Bootstrap modal code. We will use bootstrap modal for pop-up confirmation box. In bootstrap modal, first we have write id is equal to confirm modal. We will use this id attribute for pop-up modal box in jQuery code. After this, we have change modal title with text like confirmation. For display message, here we have write are you sure you want to remove this data, this message will be display under bootstrap modal. For confirm delete data, here we have write button type is equal to button, name and id is equal to ok button, by click on this button then delete data ajax request send otherwise no action will be taken here first here we have define user id variable under this variable we will store user id details now we have write dollar document with on method and under this we have write click event with delete button class delete so when user click on delete button then it will execute this block of code. Under this block, we have write user id variable equal to dollar this with attribute method, and under this we have write id, it will fetch id attribute value and store under user id variable. Below this, we have write dollar with modal id confirm modal with modal method and under this we have write show it will pop up confirm modal on web page now we have write dollar with modal button id ok button with click event so when user confirm by ok button then it will execute this block of code under this block we have start write ajax request and under this first we have write url option set to ajax crud slash destroy slash user id variable it will send get request to destroy method of ajax crud controller it will send user id variable with get request in second option we have write before send callback function this function has been called, before send of ajax request. Under this block, we have write, dollar with ok button id ok button, with text method, under this we have write deleting, this code will change ok button text with deleting text. Lastly, we have write success callback function, this function has been called after success of Ajax request. Under this function, we have write set timeout function. This callback function has been called in specified time. Here we have write 2000. So this function will called after 2 seconds. Under this function, we have write dollar with modal id confirm modal with modal method and under this we have write hide it will hide bootstrap modal after deleting of data we want to refresh data table data 
So here we have write dollar with table ID user ID with data table method dot ajax dot reload method. It will refresh data table data on web page without refresh of web page. Now we have go to destroy method of ajax crud controller. This method will request ajax request for delete data. Under this method, we have write dollar data variable is equal to ajax crud model class with find or fail method with dollar id as argument. This method will return related model based on its primary key. So, here we have store data in dollar data variable. Now here we have write dollar data variable with delete method. This method will delete data from the database. Now we have checkout in browser. Friends first we have refresh web page. After refresh of web page, now we want to remove first row of data. So here we can see delete button in each row. So we have click on delete button, after delete of button, here we can see bootstrap modal has been pop up with confirmation box, with ok and cancel button. First we have click on cancel button, then no action has been taken and bootstrap modal has been hide from web page. Now we have again click on delete button, Again we can see bootstrap modal with confirmation box, now we have click on OK button. After click on OK button, here we can see deleting button process, and after delete of data, bootstrap modal has been removed from web page, and first row of data has been removed from bootstrap data table also. So, this way we can delete or remove data from MYSQL table in Laravel 5.8 by using Ajax and Bootstrap modal. So this way we can implement Ajax CRUD in Laravel 5.8 framework. And this way we can make single page CRUD application Laravel 5.8 using Ajax. If you have any query or input regarding this video tutorial, please comment your query or input in comment box, or if you like this video tutorial please share with your friends, or even you can also share on social media also. If you want to get more update regarding our video tutorial, Please subscribe our YouTube channel for get more update regarding release of future video. Lastly keep watching our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching this video tutorial.